All right, today we're looking at a Playside G scheme, which I actually liked a lot because it was one of the only times that my mom and my wife could actually see me play because I pulled outside where they could actually see me. So it's a G scheme, what does that mean? It means the Playside guard is pulling around the edge for the Playside linebacker. So you've got the tight end and a man-to-man -man block on the defensive end. That could be a problem sometimes if the play doesn't work. That's usually why. You've got the play side tackle blocking down a tug block. The guard pulls around, hugs the tight end's down block, looking for the strong side backer. On the backside, the center probably just giving the backside guard a stab on his way up to meeting the backside backer right about over the football. The backside guard probably going to go low and try to cut on the backside here and the backside tackle, in this case the left tackle, is going to stab the defensive end and then go looking for work at the second level. The key to this play again is the tight end. If he cannot seal that defensive end, you've probably got a problem. The running back can hit it though inside off the tackles block if the defensive end plays it over the top. That happens from time to time, but as an offensive guard, your mom, everybody in the stands over here, they actually get to see you because you pull around the edge, which is nice about this G scheme. Great job, Ross, breaking down the G lead on the whiteboard. Let's take a look at it here on the video screen. You're going to get a set of big uglies right over here to your right side. You got the double tight ends here. You're going to have kick down, kick down, kick down. And you're going to get Zach Martin, the rookie officer guard, leading out here with the full back trailing. You're going to get a block back here from the center, also a block back from the guard. And when DeMarco Murray comes around this corner, he will see that Zach Martin and the fullback, they've created a huge lane for him. And the key to this run is basically getting this guard, this big lineman, out here on the perimeter, being able to kick this out here. DeMarco Murray sees nothing but green in front of him, makes one move, and he's off to the races. The G lead, it isn't as popular as it used to be, but it's still a very effective run, and the Dallas Cowboys love to use this in their run packages.